Hello and welcome! My name is Yuhua and this is my Let's Play series of Europa Universalis 4 where we are playing as Prussia. So we just finished a lot of wars in the each. We fought against Golden Horde and expanded Crimea. We fought against Muscovy and expanded Kazan. And Crimea's thank for all of this work we did for them was to be annoying. So we have to spend some of our prestige here. Then I want to enforce religion on you as well. So we also want to spend some... Uh, some of our prestige there. Uh, we still want to get rid of all of this. We want to pay back this loan. I'll give us some more income that we can spend on this corruption. And we might as well spend the corruption. Okay, and then the rest will go away once the reinforcements kick in. Um, yeah, and we had to... Uh, Stop paying for our fort. So we definitely need to look at our economy. I need to take a, a break and look for uh, look out for our economy now. Because things are getting expensive. I might need another war, another army over here. Go to Dantic instead. I think that's pretty much the best general I have. Oh, we, we made it. You go up there then. You go there. Nope, nope. Okay, and now now that we're not going... I think we're going to have to take a break from war for a little bit, so I'm, I'm thinking I'm going to fire this one guy. Um, almost suspended that army. Just so we don't... Uh, yeah, and we can spend the military points on on uh, manpower instead. Okay. So, definitely need to take a break from all the warring. Uh, get, need to get all of this land caught. Um, glory to us. Helping our new vassal out here. Okay, and now we need to look at the clergy. I think I need you to go up here somewhere. Probably here. Immortal, pr immoral prices. So, burghers lose inf influence and loyalty. Lots of peasants rise up, or we lose money. I don't want to take up a lower loan, so let's just fight some uh, some peasants. So you can take care of those two. Um, you can take care of them. You can take care of them. Uh, give you a. Of course, another general dies. Makes sense. Um, I think that was all the rebels. I'm not sure if we'll get to this one, so he might raise autonomy. Yeah. Not too much, though. Oh, there was one on Shillen as well. Uh, so you have to take that, and you're gonna have to sail to Shillen. I'll sail to Skåne and then go and deal with that. I guess you can just stay. Uh, might as well send you up here since there's a chance they'll rise up there. 
And we need to spend some of our military points. We have so many points. Dun, 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 dun. But in four years we can get to spend them on actual tech. What do we want to use this guy for? Who are you in war with? Münster. Or oh, you're in war with a with Bohemia for some reason? Interesting. Okay, yeah, we needed to deal with this. So they're rising by three a month right now. So we need to take some land from them. Clergy. You probably have some nice big fat provinces up here. Yeah, this one. And this one. This one. This one. This one. And this one. Oh, you actually have... Uh, oh, I need to get rid of those... Um, uh, what are they called? Mercenaries after this. They are also costing me money. That's not nice. So now they're really mad at me. But at least they're not exploding in my face. And another leader left us. That is not nice. Gonna have problems with these these guys, the cleric, for a long time now. I was too greedy. At least it's only costing us money. It's costing us a lot of money. We can make more claims on Sweden. Uh, let's take the Diplom, the development map mode. Yeah, let's just take Westergotland. And the last core. So, now we need 400 points and we can take this and we can start taking technology again. So, maybe I should actually take a break from warning this time. At least until my country is sorted. <sighs> Taking the blunt of the corruption and another one by the dust. Another conversion. They will soon get friendly again, at least. And we got a new air. Pretty nice air. We have had pretty good luck with our rulers in this game, I would say.
I hate seeing all these red forts. Starting to make a little bit of money again. Oh, we need to take Neuland to claim that. We have really, really been a long time since we warred, warred against free Sweden. Do we have any good allies near there? No, so we can do that as soon as we're done with admin points. We have lots of states we should also make. That could help with the money situation, but again, uh, probably more important to get finish those idea groups so we can actually start to catch up on tech. Muscovy is 95 development. That's gonna be a nice state to add. Yeah, 39 development, 17, 20, 19. That's gonna be a hell of a state. It's gonna be so expensive though, in terms of admin points. So, what are we doing with our money right now? Could we get more money somehow? I don't think we can do more. Already making... What are we making here? 61 ducats. Guess we could always try to... What are we doing with buildings? Nah, I don't want to build these for like the small provinces. It's probably not worth it. So closest army is probably this one. Just go up there. Should also have a leader. Money situation is looking way better now because we're starting to. I don't know why. Probably just because of random. Oh, by the way, um, is there any pri pirates here? Doesn't look like it. Okay, but we might as well make you on pirates instead since it's the same. means we have to let you hunt pirates though as well since otherwise you won't join. Just need to keep an eye on when they fall. It's in 49 and 50. So in three, four years we can probably, in three years we can start giving them territory back. In four years we can definitely make them start becoming happy again. So, um, it's probably an okay place to be. Yeah. Once all of these cars come back, uh, come in, we'll we'll start making some more money from trade. I'm sure. Hmm. So you need to get down there. It's really, like I've talked about this before, it's really annoying that it's one month, one seat to take. Like that's the only reason I can see for actually getting defensiveness is so that you can get, actually have a chance to get to the... Um, Rebels before they increase uh, autonomy because at some point there's just no way of getting being close enough to all of them. I guess we can send you up there and then send you over here. But yeah, we need to consolidate our country a little bit. We have been expanding 
a little bit too much, I think. And how are subjects doing? They're all pretty, pretty nice. And we can get uh, the claim on Norland now. And you rebelled over there, of course. New Holy Roman Empire or Emperor. Continue. Okay, we can definitely go let that Chernigov. Oh, we can't make that go away because that's already a stack there. Um, yeah, you go back there, be ready to help Kassan if they need it. In w one year we can take this tech. Soon we can take the last one of these ideas. And then we can start getting this tech. Oh, so we're gonna have to refuse to aid the traders because we don't have any money. Oh my god, we're losing a lot of money. Why are we losing so much? Oh, um, yeah, I think we're gonna have to not reduce corruption that much while they get back. And running. Okay. And so now it's costing us less than 400 points to actually buy admin tech. Did Noah have certain insult? That's interesting. I think they're feeling a little big for themselves. Oh, we don't have to pay to get rid of corruption now. That is nice. If we activate the force, we'll be losing a lot of money. So, we don't do that. Okay, I, I need you two to actually combine. This is just being annoying. Stuff like that just annoys me. I don't know why. I can't really explain it, but I can't stand seeing two navies right next to each other not combining. Can we add some more to the fleet? Yes, we can. 10% towards integrating you. Uh, you go and deal with that. And can we hire a... Diplomatic Repetition guy. We just need some money. So we get the next idea group at 22. And we're probably going to be able to buy all the way to 20 before we are on time, yeah we are, because yeah, this is gonna happen soon. I mean, it would be nice if we could do it within the next three years, so we don't have to wait for manufactories or lose money to manufactories. And soon it is, yeah, Crimea, we wanna, we wanna be married with you. Kassan, do you wanna be married as well? Yeah, that seems like a nice idea. 
And we did some conversions. How are we doing with our church powers? Now we can change this one out to... Do we want a little bit of real prestige gain? Could also go for the production efficiency to make some of the money. Yeah, let's do that. It's gonna make us a bunch of money, I think. Yep. And we have new troops. Which ones? New cannons. Gotta get an extra fire pip, an extra morale damage pip. Very nice. And you are suffering attrition. I just want somewhere where I can place this. Well, I guess I'm just gonna live here lead them. Anyway, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, consider the like button, subscribing. Hope to see you next time, and until then, have a good day.